Good evening. I'm Aaron Ty with AaronStrains.Weebly.com and also with Lionel.com. Today we're just going to take a look at a review of the um, Pocono Berkshire set. Yes, it's finally from Train World from my, and this model was made from Lionel. Okay, so now um, let's go ahead and clear everything out of here. Abracadabra. Okay, so everything is um, disappeared, as, as you can see. Now we can start our review. Let's go ahead and do that right Okay, now. so here's the um, front front of the boiler. We got the headlight right there. A nice uh, swinging little bell, like the Santa Fe used to have, but it broke off. Uh, well, I can't, well, I know can't um, really repair that. Once the bell is broken, it's broken for life. Um, so, um, don't break the bell. It's, and it uh, swings freely. Just like the Santa Fe used to did, used to do. I'll do it. Um, we haven't done a review on the Santa Fe yet, but we'll get to that um, in a later date. Okay, so let's go ahead and take a closer look. As I said before, the boiler um, that you and there are two marker lights up there. Um, this um, road number of the train is le legible. All the other reviews I did are legible. Um, this one is 3510. So, um, it says neat, and I'll have to show you the top. Okay, so let's look at the top. Okay, so here's the top of the unit. We got a, um, smokestack with the, um, smoke unit inside. And just like the other trains, like my New York Central and my Santa Fe, the Santa Fe hasn't been reviewed yet. Um, I'll get to that at a later date. Um, so we got these, um, so as you can see, it's a different color here. It's blue. Really like it, and it's really cool. Lionel, um, Lionel kind of um, did this already, but they painted it um, a blue, a light bluish color. Um, and here we are. We got another dome here, and some, and there's another pop up dome there. It doesn't pop up really. And there are two vents, but they don't slide. Um, there are other, there are other trains that are. Those are the premium sets, and the premium sets will probably come with these um sliding doors. Um. Anyway, I'm only reviewing regular sets, the um, starter sets, so you probably won't see them much often. I don't know if I'll do um premium sets, but I'll do them in a later in a later future. Anyway, let's um, go ahead. Take a look at the side side of the engine. As you see, it's a 284 Berkshire uh, with the Lackawanna coal tender with coal on top. Um, this whistle, okay, this whistle, uh, whistle and bell effect may have came with other came with other steam engines, so it may not be a fan fan made one, but that, that's okay. Um, the two marker lights. Um, light up and everything so that's okay I mean you know so here's the Lackawanna um, boxcar um, this this boxcar comes with a sliding door like all of them might but I don't know and the door slides open and you got a nice interior okay let's close back up okay this is the blue coal Tender, and what it is is that it's coal, but but it's detail coal. Okay, so here's the Lackawanna um, reserve car. And, um, as you see, it's it's a cage with bears, and as you see there, it says Lackawanna Country, Lackawanna Reserve, protecting wildlife for future generations. And there's some on the other side too. Look at that. Very cool. And last but not least is the caboose. The caboose is gonna looks like that one, that one right there. The BNSF Maxi.com freight set caboose. Well, yep. As you see, it has um top win top windows, some um, some other windows and some lights too. Um, and in, and in the front, it's um well very. Very um very nicely detailed. So, so yeah, um the other 
the, the other employers needed um, some help building these, so I helped them out. And so, from there on, we um, got this done. This, this whole Berkshire set. Okay, so now I'm going to start it up and run it. Okay, so I'm going to start the engine up, and we'll take it around the layout. And this may be um, familiar to all, to all of you, the whistle. But maybe the bell might might not be, I don't, I don't know. But you'll soon find out. Alright, so there we are. We got the uh, Lackawanna up and running. Uh, as you see, the headlights on. Alright, I'm just going to sound the whistle. Alright, so that was the whistle. Now here comes the bell. Now like Vision Line steam engines, they do not have the swinging bell. This one does not have the swinging bell that um, swings back and forth along with the motion of the bell. Our Vision Line steam engines might have that. Um, just look for them. Alright, time to listen to one of the crew talk sounds. Dispatcher here, you're cleared off the main. Over. Roger that, cleared outbound. Out. Dispatcher here, you're cleared off the main. Over. Roger that, I'm taking the green. Out. Dispatcher here, you're cleared off the main. Over. It has more, but I won't play them all because they may seem annoying afterwards. We'll just go ahead and run the engine. I forgot how to switch directions. There we are. It's 
sometimes it doesn't shut down all the way. It doesn't make the shut off sequence, but that's okay. I'll just end this review right now. I'm Eric Ty, and I'll see you next time.